In this video we are going to find out the integral of cot inverse x. So in order to integrate this function we will use integration by parts. So first of all we will suppose u is equal to cot inverse x and dv is equal to dx and then we will take the derivative of u. So we have the differential du and the derivative of cot inverse x is minus 1 upon 1 plus x square dx and here we will take the integral of both sides so we have v is equal to x. Now the formula of integration by parts is integral of u dv is equal to uv minus integral of v du. Now we will put the value of u, v, du and dv in this formula. So we have integral of u. So the value of u is cot inverse x and the value of dv is dx and then we will put the value of u which is cot inverse x and then the value of v which is x then minus integral of v and the value of v is x and then the value of du which is minus 1 upon 1 plus x square dx minus 1 upon 1 plus x square dx now the integral of cot inverse x dx is equal to x times cot inverse x minus multiply by minus 1 is plus integral of x upon 1 plus x square and we can write this dx with this x now in order to integrate this function we will suppose 1 plus x square as t so we will let t is equal to 1 plus x square then the differential dt is equal to the derivative of 1 plus x square and the derivative of 1 is 0 and the derivative of x square is 2x multiply by dx now we have to put the value of x dx over here so we can take this 2 on the other side of equation so we have ad upon 2 is equal to x dx now we will put the value of x dx over here and the value of 1 plus x square which is equal to t over here so the integral of cot inverse x dx is equal to x times cot inverse x plus integral of dt upon 2 over t. Now the integral of cot inverse x dx is equal to x cot inverse x plus now we will write this 2 as 1 upon 2 in front of the integral so we have half of half times integral of 1 upon 2 1 upon t dt and we know that the integral of 1 upon t is ln t so we have x cot inverse x plus half of ln of t plus c where c is the constant of integration now we will put the value of t which is 1 plus x square so we have x times cot inverse x plus half ln of 1 plus x square plus c so the integral of cot inverse x is x times cot inverse x plus half of half times ln of 1 plus x square plus c